This video will show you how to create your works cited page the really fast and really correct way using a website called EasyBib. I'll start out by going up here to the address bar and typing in EasyBib. My first item is a book so I have to click on book. I notice that it says MLA and that is the style that I need. I'm typing in the title and it's a very long title but I'm gonna try it just the main part of the title. I click cite this. So now it's looking for results and it did find some and indeed this is the one I want so I clicked cite. Now I'm checking to see that this is the print version and it is. They want me to confirm the information in case they made a mistake and there is a mistake because Ananda is the illustrator. She is not an author so I will remove that. I see that they've made some capitalization errors so I'm capitalizing all the important words of the title. I have to go over a little bit. A long title. Of course, I don't have to capitalize the word and. But I do have to capitalize always the first and last word and all the important words. Create the citation. Perfect. My next item is also a book. And this one I'm going to try entering the ISBN which I found on the back of the book. And cite this. It did find the book. That's the one and it looks like everything is correct on that so I will click create the citation. Next I'm going to try creating a website uh, a website citation going to my favorite website right here highlight the URL at the top in the address bar and copy it with a command C. Now I'm back here. I want to be sure that I'm on website because it will do it differently if I still am on book. I just paste in with a command P, I'm sorry, a command V, my website title until it cite this. And they did find the correct information and I will click continue Again, this is an online site, a website citation. They don't know the author, but I do, so I'll enter that information. And there is no publisher, and it was electronically published, well, today, so I'll enter that information. That's this latest update and click create the citation. Okay, so there's two books and a web page. I think I'm ready to put these into my uh, paper, so I'm going to click save for later. That asks me to register. It is not necessary for me to register. So I'm just going to go back and I'm going to click instead export. I'm going to save it to Google Docs. Now it's going to ask me to sign in to my Google Docs, but I'm already signed in in my case. It wants to know can EasyBib use a Google Doc? Yes, I want them to, so I will choose allow access. And now it's working. Okay, it's completed 
and I have a choice now to go back to my bibliography and add some more or go on to Google Docs and see how it turned out. I think I'll do that. Check it out. It's perfect. It even fixed the uh, alphabetizing on my Google Doc. Now it has more than one of these because I had to try this video a couple of times. So now for my works cited I can either copy all of this and paste it into my one document with the rest of my paper or I can print this as a separate page because the hanging indent and uh, title of the page are all completed for me. And that's how to use EasyBib to create a works cited page the easy way.